हेलो स्टूडेंट इन इन दिस क्लास वी विल स्टार्ट न्यू चैप्टर व्हिच इज मेजरमेंट फर्स्ट व्हाट इज मेजरमेंट मेजरमेंट इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ कंपैरिजन ऑफ द गिवन गिवन फिजिकल क्वांटिटी विद द नॉन स्टैंडर्ड क्वांटिटी ऑफ द सेम नेचर विद द standard quantity of same nature now the standard quantity used to measure the given physical quantity that is known as unit the standard quantity used to measure the given physical quantity is called the unit hence we can say to measure any physical quantity we require two things what are first unit why unit actually if uh, uh, if i am writing here 28 then can you tell me what is this which type of physical quantity is this we can't decide we are not able to decide that which quantity uh, is this because it have no unit but if i am writing here 28 second then you can tell me that ma'am it is time or if i am writing here 28 cm then you can tell me easily that ma'am uh, it uh, this uh, this value is showing the length okay so uh, for representing any uh, physical quantity we need basically two things first is numerical value and second is unit what is the numerical value numerical value which expresses how many times the unit is contained in the given quantity while the unit it shows that which type of quantity is to be measured okay now next is type of physical quantities there are two types of physical quantities first is basic or fundamental or second is derived first basic physical quantities what are basic phys uh, physical quantities those quantities that are independent of any other quantities or that can uh, neither be changed or can be related to any other fundamental quantities are known as basic quantities for example mass length time temperature current etc now next is derived those quantities that can be expressed in terms of basic physical quantities for example area volume density force speed acceleration 
etc because as we know area is given by length into breadth and both length and breadth are the basic quantities so as area can be written in term of basic quantity so it is derived quantity now volume similarly volume can be written in, uh, as length into breadth into height so it is also it can be written in term of basic quantity so volume is also basic quantity next speed speed is distance per unit time and distance and time both are the basic quantity so again speed can also be written in term of basic quantity so it is also derived quantity next system of units first cgs in cgs system first c this represents centimeter g it represent gram and s stand for second means in this system of unit length is measured in centimeter mass is measured in gram and time is measured in second now next is fps in this system again length is measured in f for foot p means mass is measured in pound and time is measured in second next mks system in this system length is measured in meter mass is measured by kilogram and time is measured in second the above mentioned system are now no longer used and they are only of historical importance now we use si system of units which is an enlarged and modified version of the metric system so third system is si system means international system of units in 1960 the general conference of weight and measure recommended that in addition to the units of length mass and time the units of temperature luminous intensity current and the amount of substance also be taken as fundamental units the units of angle and solid angle are the complementary fundamental units for si system the following table gives the fundamental quantities their units and their standard symbols first column is for quantity second for unit and third symbol first is length in si system length is measured in meter and symbol is m small m next is mass it is measured in kilogram and symbol is kg third is time it is measured in second and symbol it symbol is second symbol is small s fourth is temperature it is measured in si system by in kelvin and symbol is capital k fifth is electric current the si unit of electric current is ampere and symbol is capital a next is amount of substance its unit is mole and symbol is m o l next is luminous intensity its unit is candela and its symbol is c d 
small c t. So this is the table for SI unit of seven basic quantities, which are length, mass, time, temperature, electric current, luminous intensity, and amount of substance. Next, the table for derived quantities. in SI system. Now, first is physical quantity, second column is unit, third column is symbol, first quantity is area. As we know, Area is given by length into breadth and in SI system length and breadth means length is measured in meter so its unit will be meter into meter and in symbolic form we can return it as we can write it as meter square. Second is volume. As we know volume is length into breadth into height. So its unit will be meter into meter into meter and in symbolic form we can write meter cube. Next is density. As we know density is defined as mass per unit volume. Mass, the SI unit of mass is kilogram per volume and the SI unit of volume is meter cube so its unit will be kilogram kg per meter cube next is speed as we know speed is defined as distance per unit time and the unit of distance, the SI unit of distance is meter and the SI unit of time is second. So SI unit of speed becomes meter per second. Next is acceleration. The SI unit of velocity is also meter per second. Next is acceleration. As we know acceleration is change in velocity upon time. Since SI unit of velocity is meter per second and SI unit of time is second. So SI unit of acceleration will be meter per second square. Next is force. As we know force can be written as product of mass and acceleration. And as we know the SI unit of mass is kilogram and SI unit of acceleration is meter per second square. So the SI unit of force becomes kilogram into meter per second square or we can write it as Newton or it is denoted by capital N. Next is work or energy. Work is defined as force into displacement. Since SI unit of force is kilogram into meter per second square and displacement, the SI unit of displacement is meter. So the SI unit of work becomes kilogram into meter square per second square. Or we can write it as as we know the SI unit of force is Newton. So we can write it as Newton into meter. Or we can also write it as Joule. It is denoted by capital J. Next is power. Power is defined as work per unit time. Since SI unit of work is Joule. And SI unit of time is second. 
सो ऐसा यूनिट ऑफ पावर विकम जूल पर सेकेंड और वी कैन राइट इट एज वाट डब्ल्यू ए डबल टी सो थैंक यू स्टूडेंट इन नेक्स्ट क्लास वी विल डिस्कस स्केलर और वैक्टर क्वांटिटीज और ऐसा यूनिट ऑफ सम अदर डिराइव क्वांटिटी और ऐसा ही प्रिफिक्स थैंक यू